and welcome to Key News. Today our very own John Lemon will be interviewing historian and scientist Bill Nye and YouTube genius Michael Stevens from Vsauce, who explained to us one of science's most controversial topics in the 1600s, the geocentric solar system model versus the heliocentric solar system model. What are you talking about, Harlow? Everyone knows that the geocentric model is correct. Who ever heard of the sun as the center of the solar system? Stuff from teaching around the Earth. I get so mad when people tell me that the sun is, is the center. Ah! Oh my gosh, put that away! Oh, oh, sorry, Harlow. I'm Poppy Harlow. And I'm Wolf Blitz, and you're watching Pew News. Our interviewer, Don Lemon, has just arrived to interview our fellow two scientists. Hold up, we have breaking news. A gang of doggos has just ready to bank. This gang, um, Harlow, the science thing. Oh yeah, sorry. Our interviewer, Don Lemon, has arrived with scientists Vsauce and Bill Nye. Down to you, Lemon. Thanks, Harlow. So Bill Nye and Vsauce, can you explain how we came up with the idea of the geocentric and heliocentric models? Well, Lemon. Hey, Vsauce. Michael here. Well, Lemon, the geocentric model was first thought of by a man named Ptolemy in 100 AD. It satisfied many people because it was able to explain how stars and celestial bodies moved around Earth. It stated that Earth was the center of the solar system and all of the planets and stars revolved around it. This is the correct planet model. The heliocentric model was first described by Aristarchus of Samos. This was in the 3rd century BCE. The heliocentric model explains that the Sun is the center of the solar system, not Earth. Later, Galileo expanded on the heliocentric model. So, Bill, what was the big controversy between these two models? Well, Lemon, in the 17th century, the Catholic Church supported the geocentric model. The Church had much power back then, and all opposed to them would be jailed or executed. When ideas of the heliocentric model by Galileo started to gain momentum, the Church acted out. They killed and imprisoned all opposed to the geocentric model. That is politically incorrect, just like your show. A heliocentric model is correct. The heliocentric model was accepted by most scientists because scientists noticed that something was weird with Mars's orbit. It appeared to be moving backwards. When the heliocentric model was developed, it explained this weird rotation because Earth has had a smaller orbit than Mars. When Earth passes Mars in its orbit, it appears backwards. Now with our new technology and telescopes, it is easy to tell if the heliocentric model is more accurate. You wanna go? Let's do this. Thanks, Bill. I'll just leave you guys to fight. Back to you, Arlo. <gasps> That's it! <laughs> what? Oh yeah, thanks Lemon for the science thingy stuff. Now it's time for everybody's favorite segment, the presidential election. Yay! Good evening and welcome to the fabulous Fox Theater in downtown Detroit, the site of the 11th Republican presidential debate. This year's election will be the most intense election in several decades. Today's debate will be between our four unqualified Republicans. We'll be back after this commercial break. Our first candidate is business mogul, hair enthusiast, and current president, President Business. Our second candidate is multi-billionaire and Facebook founder, Mark Zuckerberg. Our third candidate is famous street robber and probably the least qualified Republican, Tupac. Our final Republican, and the most qualified, is our Lord and Savior, Thanos. Sadly, violence broke out during the debate due to President Business insulting Thanos' hairline. But on the bright side, no deaths were reported. There have been many debates throughout history about the Earth's true shape. People say that the Earth is brown while others say it's flat. We will meet scientist and meme legend Robbie Ron to discuss about on the matter. Interview time. Please welcome Robbie Rotten. 
So, Robbie, is the Earth flat? Obviously, Harlow, the Earth is flat, and it is most certainly not round. Please explain, Robbie, why is the Earth flat? The Earth has a very large ice wall surrounding us, and a turtle balancing on the planet, which is scientific. What is this turtle that you speak of? I have horrible news. I just found out that the Earth is actually the shape of a fidget spinner. Wait, what? There have been many reports about a secret flat Earth and geocentric society causing chaos around the city. Also, Moon Review is getting cancelled by PewDiePie due to T-Series taking over. All our memes are endangered. Why is the world falling apart? What do you want? Well, I've been informed that our ratings are in the negatives right now, and our show is getting cancelled. Wait, what? How am I supposed to get paid for rent? Goodbye, world, and have a terrible day. We won't miss you.